on the last video. Uh, 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 full nudity? Uh, Lady Anne's gonna... I'm gonna come. And so we continue. Don't forget, from today on, our hideout's going to be at the Shibuya Passageway. Oh, that reminds me. Mishima said Nakanohara should be in Shibuya too. Okay, guess we're heading straight there. Yo! Yo! We're about to head to the hideout too. Sick. Who's that? It's, it's just Nakanohara. Excuse me. Hey, what's up, man? That's Nakanohara. Mishima told us to meet him here in Shibuya today. For real? My name is Nakanohara. Natsuiko Nakanohara. The one who was posted about on the Phantom Aficionado website. He seems pretty nice. Doesn't seem like the stalker type. I think the change of heart must have worked. The administrator of that website contacted me. They told me to look for someone in a Shujin uniform with a cat. <laughs> so, what do you want? You may have already heard, but there's someone I wish to trigger a change of heart in. An artist by the name of Madarame. Ah, gotcha. <gasps> you think this is it? Is the pupil gonna confess his master's secrets? His shadow did mention Madarame as well. I'm one of Madarame's former pupils. He gave me lodging at his home, where I thought only about art. I genuinely wanted to be an artist. There was another pupil as well. A very talented man, multiple years my senior. Obviously, Madarame kept tabs on him. Everything he made was claimed as a Madarame original. He wasn't the only victim, though. Right. We got some real proof of the plagiarism. In response to Madarame's actions, that senior pupil committed suicide. Oh, Jesus. Suicide? He must have been unable to bear seeing his work praised under Madarame's name. That was when I disobeyed Madarame's orders and left. But he quickly pressured other parts of the art world, and my life as a painter was destroyed. I tried to turn over a new leaf, working at a ward office, but it was no use. My attachment to art warped my emotions. Soon, I began getting attached to everything. In the end, I even turned into a stalker. <laughs> I'd like to ask again. Please, make Madarame have a change of heart. Yikes, man. That is quite the story. Yeah, we'll get right on that. As soon as I get around to it. Not only for me, it's to save the life of another man as well. Save their life? Oh! Oh, right. Um. Oh, what was his name? Yusuke. Even now, there's still one young man remaining under Madarame's tutelage. Yeah, it's I Yusuke. Think he's about your age. Yeah. That has to be Yusuke. Yeah. Not only is he a talented artist, he also owes Madarame for taking him in after his mother passed. He is the perfect target. So Yusuke's got no choice but to listen. That's a bummer. I actually spoke to him a few times back when I was still living at Madarame's. I asked him if he found it painful to stay with Madarame. And you know what he said? If I could leave, I would. Kitago Akun. I have no right to say this given my prior cowardice, but I don't want to see another suicide. I'd like to find a way to save this young man. He has a bright future ahead of him. Me Please too. consider that when thinking about changing Madarame's heart. Yeah, definitely. We've been asked to act directly on behalf of one of Madarame's victims. It sounds like we don't have the time to deliberate whether or not to change Madarame's heart. Yeah. We gotta go save Yusuke. Hell yeah! Madarame's just a piece of shit who preys on the weak. Suicide. I'll never let something like that happen. Plus, we finally got to hear how Kitagawa-kun really feels. Well, since we've reached a unanimous decision, how about we continue this at our new hideout? Yeah, let's do it. My fellow thieves, welcome to our new hideout. Our target to be this here. time <laughs> is Madarame. We all saw that palace. We'll pay dearly if we assume it's just going to be like the last one. And furthermore, Lady An's chastity is on the line. <laughs> what? 
need to do what we did with Kamoshida. First, we secure an infiltration route in the palace. After that, we send our calling card. Once the treasure has materialized, we steal it. Oh, All right. Oh, I got a question. Uh, Madarame doesn't know that we were doing stuff in the palace yet. Why are we already getting treated like criminals in there? You're learning, Ryuji. Well done. It must be because he doesn't trust anyone. Any unknown person may as well be an enemy. Hmm. Or maybe Lovely. he's just super salty from all those rumors that have been spreading about him. That's also possible. And his palace being so crazy had nothing to do with us? Either way, we should stay on our best behavior. It'll be harder for us to steal the treasure if we needlessly increase the security level. We need to be careful of Kitagawa-kun this time, too. I'm sure that whatever he sees will just get passed on to Madarame. That's yeah, right. probably. Hey, what is Madarame's treasure going to look like anyway? Another crown? Uh, probably that. some artwork or something. But my sixth sense will know when I see it. Oh yeah, you go completely nuts, huh? Our time limit is when the exhibit ends, right? That means June fifth. Got it. We'll carry out the plan after we've sent out the calling card. So our infiltration route will need to be set in stone two days prior on June second. Now listen here. We can't mess this up, no matter what, okay? Yes, ma'am. Damn. Okay. This is the first job for Fox Strikers, so let's make sure we do it right. Come on. It's time to get this mission started. Your mission to change Madarame's heart has begun. You must steal this treasure by the deadline. Mission start! Special obstacles and palaces. Occasionally, you will encounter palace obstacles that are impassable and require interacting with the target in the real world. What? <laughs> Why? You will need to leave the palace to find the obstruction. Enter palaces quickly to find obstacles and triumph over challenges before the deadline. Uh, okay. But first I want to go do something. That's all for today? Yeah, I want to go... Uh, I want to go see what uh, is in store for me at the Velvet Room. So I'm just going to head there real quick. And here we are. Actually, while I'm thinking about it, can I go back in here? See what this guy has for sale? What's up? You again. Need to ask him about the modified model guns. So, what are you here for? Want to talk about the bag? I could ask him if I had dauntless guts. Come on. Should we not? Maybe taking on the Big Bang Challenge would help. Are you for real? Fine. I want to make a purchase. Designed to help heal wounds heal. Yeah. That one, do I get? Yes. I am now broke. Awesome. Uh, come again. You're done here. Go home. This ain't no place for kids to be hanging around. Thanks, man. He was, he was such a nice guy. Anyway, let's go in here now. Hey! You don't have time to be playing around, inmate. Hurry back to your prison. God. Ow. Jerk. <laughs> it seems you've gotten used to coming here. You must surely be accustomed to infiltrating palaces by now. It stresses me out. Regardless, you have yet to obtain a truly acceptable number of personas. This is not the full potential of the power of the wild card. Hmm. I suppose this is a prime opportunity to help further your rehabilitation along. Don't worry. This assignment is not mandatory. Think of it almost as a test of strength. What's the assignment? Now... 
We will have to sp you will we will have you bring back bring us the mask we specify. Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> we you just got to show us the persona we ask for. First off, we would like for you to bring us a Jack Frost. <sighs> That's too easy, Justine. It should to be it should be a challenge. It should be a challenge. Hmm. I wanted to have Mabufu too. Mabufu. Listen up, inmate. Got that, inmate? Bring us a Jack Frost with Mabufu. Farewell. Very well. We uh, we ask for Jack Frost with Mabufu. Please speak to us again when you have it. This will not be mandatory for your rehabilitation, but you will be handsomely rewarded for it. <laughs> I encourage you to at least try your hand at this. Oh, it's easy. I just gotta combine the right personas. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna leave now. No slacking off. Yeah. So I gotta find. Hmm. Yeah, no, I, I gotta find, I gotta make, rather, I gotta make Jack Frost with Mabufu. This is not the way I was supposed to be going. Hmm. Quite the challenge. I accept. I'm gonna get out of here now. I want to head to the doctor real quick. Hello, doctor. I'm here for my checkup. <sighs> the warmer it gets, the stranger people act. Like that perverted high school teacher. Has anyone ever studied the correlation between the rise in temperature and the rise in weirdos? Huh. It is weird, now that you think about it. Anyway, we're not here to talk about that. So what are you here for today? I want to do the clinical trial. I made some more refinements to the medicine. Could I have you come in? I feel I can become closer with Takumi thanks to the death persona Mandrake. I feel my bond with Takumi will grow stronger soon. So, what are you going to do? Want to hang out with Takumi? Yes, I would. In that case, go to the exam room, huh? So, this is the Takami Medical Clinic of Inter Internal Medicine. I'm glad it's still open. Sorry, I have a child that I need to have examined. Oh. Looks like I have a patient with an emergency. And? So, why come here? Aren't you under the care of another hospital? I've heard rumors about this place. I'd like for you to examine her. She was diagnosed with bronchitis, but the medicine she was given hasn't been working at all. She has a fever that won't go away, and she's losing weight because she's not hungry. A young girl losing weight is definitely not good. You should go to a bigger hospital. I can't provide a thorough examination here. We've been going to a bigger hospital. A university hospital in East Shinjuku. But all they tell us is that it's persistent bronchitis. <sighs> a university hospital in East Shinjuku. The doctor there performs exams like he's on an assembly line. I think he's famous or something. A famous doctor, huh? I'm just a general practitioner out here in the sticks. As you can see, I don't even have any staff. Wait, I've heard there's a medicine that can only be acquired here. Please, I'll, I'll pay you. Please. A at least just examine her. Hey! Uh, 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 hold on. <coughs> Doctor, my chest really hurts. <sighs> Dr. Takami will help. Is your vision blurry? How about your throat? Does it hurt? Hmm. No signs of swelling. 
Are you sure you've told me everything about her symptoms and treatments you've tried so far? Yes, I I'm sure. Hmm. Hello? Hello? Oehara-san? This is Dr. Schweizer there. Is Dr. Schweizer there? There's something I'd like to ask him about a case that was in last month's medical journal. I see. Guess the ones in stock will have to do. There's a shelf by the reception desk. Bring the contents of the second drawer into the exam room. You'll need to help me administer the medicine. Also, bring the beaker with the red label in the fridge. A towel, wash basin, and measuring spoon. Fine. Well, what are you waiting for? Get moving! D okay yes ma'am. Thank you so much. I didn't expect her to recover so quickly. Hmm. It was a very unique strain of an infectious disease. It can't be detected by conventional exams. I temporarily suppressed the symptoms. I'll make adjustments as her condition improves. Okay, that'll be one million yen for today. Uh, what? A million yen? That's outrageous! You're completely taking advantage of- I mean, uh, alright. I agreed to pay. You don't take credit cards, do you? I'll, with go I'll withdraw some cash right now. What? Huh? Wait, you're actually going to pay? By the way, that famous doctor you mentioned earlier? Was it Medical Chief of Staff Oyamata? Yes. Are you familiar with him? I knew it. In that case, I'll make this free of charge. Damn! Free? <laughs> you seem happy. <laughs> Doesn't it feel good, treating his patient without permission? By the way... By the way, thanks to your outburst earlier, I'm going to perform a very special exam on you today. Uh... So is he your... Uh, assistant? Seems awfully young. Yes, my assistant, guinea pig. He's, a, he's about to be... He's about to put in a lot of hard work today, aren't you? Uh... <laughs> Okay. Feels like my bond with Takami is growing even deeper. Ooh! Yay! Rank up. All right. Sweet. Um, Doctor, can I go back to school now? Not for a while. You need to start eating and regain your strength first. Can you do that for me? Yes. Thank you, Doctor. Don't mention it. Your turn. I wonder what kind of response you'll have this time. Maybe you won't even be able to make it home. Uh, maybe not <laughs> do that in front of the patients. Alright. I feel like cooperating in that shady clinical trial has increased my guts. Only a little bit? I need to have dauntless guts to be able to talk to to that guy about the gun. Ugh. Bye. Okay, good work today. Oh? How are you feeling now? Today's drug was kind of a rough one, huh? But maybe it was just that my careless little guinea pig deserved, huh? Especially after approving that girl's consultation without my permission. I'll... Uh, I'll reflect on my mistakes. <laughs> Good boy. But I'm only letting this go today. Don't pull anything like that again. Okay. The drug does seem to be more stable compared to the early stages, though. Probably thanks to your cooperation. Feels like I'm almost there, so try not to die just yet, okay? Yeah, okay. Alright, take care. Ah, your 
back. Yes, I am. Don't forget to ask that airsoft guy about the paper. I'm trying. I'm trying, but I don't have dauntless guts. <sighs> Maybe a crossword puzzle will take my mind off of it. Hmm. There are still customers here at this hour. Customers of ugh. customers in LeBlanc. Customers in LeBlanc will go home after listening in on them by a bit. Try doing this when you need to do activities in the cafe. I mean, why not? Hey, we're heading out. This place is closing soon. What? But I want to watch TV. There's a special on that guy they call a Detective Prince, a catchy. What? Okay. They're still doing the news. You'll make it home in time. Besides, you can see his face anytime. That pretty boy's been on TV a lot lately. Well, thanks for the coffee. A catchy, huh? Uh. I'm gonna do my crossword puzzle now. Hey, hey! Are you gonna play crossword puzzles? You have other stuff to do, so don't get too into it. I'm just gonna... Dude, let me enjoy my crossword puzzles. Jeez. Where art is shown off and sold. Oh, that one's easy. That's gallery. I'm not gonna finish it, because I wanna let, I wanna do these other ones. Mustachioed realist. Or mustachioed surrealist. Hmm. Paris Museum. I know that one. It's the Louvre. I forget how to spell it. But it's, it's something like that. Right? Hang on, let me look it up. A few moments later. Yep, that's right. Alright, let's see. Wall artwork. Hmm. I'm not quite sure. Stashio surrealist. I don't know. I don't I don't know that one. Oh wait. Isn't this one? Mustachioed Surrealist. Okay, forgetting the why, because it's in gallery. Hmm. No. Wait. Is it Dolly? Because I definitely don't know anybody named Bali. Ah, <laughs> uh, whatever. It doesn't even matter. These small ones don't even really matter. <sighs> Excuse me. These smaller ones don't really matter. It's just the one in blue circles that... Uh, ...really counts. Yeah. It's a gallery. An art gallery. Gallery. A room or corridor where artwork is on display. The gallery is also the area where observers group together for all sorts of events. From court to golf tournaments. Wait, what? Never heard of a golf tournament being held in a gallery. Oh, wait, wasn't there... Wasn't there that one... golf tournament that was held indoors for an event? I can't remember what it's for. I'll look it up and show you guys later. In post. But I... 
I don't... Mm. I'm sure... I'm, I know I've seen it before. I haven't been there, but I, I've seen photos of it. Yeah, no, I couldn't find it. Anyway. It can also refer to a society at large, especially in regards to the majority opinion. Oh yeah, like a peanut gallery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or even a passageway made by an animal, such as the tunnel system of a mole. Oh, that's the word gallery. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. All right. I see. Oh, wow. Even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. Maybe you got a little smarter after solving these crossword puzzles. I hope so. Gotta be smart to solve those. All right, I feel, uh, excuse me. Excuse me. I feel like going out for a bit. Hey. All right, make sure you don't get dragged into some weird mess, all right? Yes, sir. I want to go back to Central Square and check out that one political dude. It's this way. Anyway, I'll see you guys there. Made it. Also, it was Station Square, not Central Square. I'm dumb. Anyway, let's check this guy out. Hello. Please consider what I have to say. There have been far too many incidents recently to ignore. Can anyone deny this? The runaway train accident, mysterious psychotic breakdowns, a school with a corrupt teacher. We have yet to discover the truth of it all. The apathy that permeates society is a direct insult of negligence by our government and the media. You, you're listening quite attentively. Are you interested in politics? I mean, I myself am not particularly interested. I'll still watch it. I just don't care for it. But for this instance, I will say I'm interested. Are you a student? I'm delighted to captivate the interest of someone your age. Hmm? Hmm. Have I seen you somewhere before? Oh, you were working at the beef bowl shop before. You have a lot of perseverance for a young person. If you'd like. Well, if you're interested, I could use your help. I want to change the state of this country. And to do so, I need the power of the youth. However, due to certain regulations, I can't offer a job to a student. I was thinking you could learn some things if you chose to attend a few of my speeches, though. I'd be glad to. Really? That would be helpful indeed. Well then, would you mind telling me your name and contact information? Sure. Why not? You're a student from Shujin Academy, hmm? It's nice to meet you. I'm Toran... Oh my gosh. Toranosuke Yoshida. Toranosuke Yoshida. Nailed it. <sighs> I used to be a member of the Diet, but no longer. In the past 20 years, I've lost seven straight elections. How old are you? Seven straight elections. Hmm. Yeah, whatever. This isn't good. I'm dwelling on the negative right before my speech. Very well. Well then, I hope I can count on your help immediately. Sure, why not, man? <laughs> I'll just hold up this sign. The lines of what is considered right and wrong in society today have been blurred. With common sense no longer our guide, we make decisions based on our selfish wants and desires. This has resulted in a deluge of self-centered people who delight in taking advantage of the weak. However, however, in this modern day and age, it is imperative that we act in the best interests of all. The world where a world where it is acceptable to trample on the rights of others for your own benefit 
A world where the young exist only to be exploited is a world that must be changed. <laughs> Easy for you to say. Old timers like me have our hands full of taking care of ourselves. He's actually making some good points, but he's a no name. He probably won't get too far. Nothing's gonna change. We'll just keep getting exploited. What's this wannabe politician blathering about now? He isn't even affiliated with the party. How about you just leave matters of the state into the capable hands of the liberal co-prosperity party? Oh my god, there's so much being there's so much terminology being thrown around here. I have no idea if it's number one, true. Number two, if it's, you know important. I don't know. I don't know. This is, this is a lot, man. You mustn't base your decision on those whom to on wh whom to support merely according to the party they belong to. Wow, this guy was ahead of his time, wasn't he? Actually, no, it was even for the current time. Ah, just shut up already. You're just a washed up politician. <laughs> If I am chosen to represent the will of the people, then I am fully prepared to in the best interests of all. Ha! <laughs> Save the blathering for when you get elected. If you get elected. Thank you. Thank you. That is for all to that is all for today. Well, what did you think of my speech? Uh Best interests of all? I'm glad. Indeed. Do you feel the same? Such as I am, I'd like to believe that I'm capable of giving a moving speech. However, there are times like today when the audience has a difference of opinion on a topic. Some feel I should concentrate on getting elected before I worry about others. Do you agree? Um... Hey, he seems like a decent dude. You have my support. Thank you. It's encouraging to know that my message has won you over. Besides, I have grown quite accustomed to those types of reactions. No. Although, I don't know if that is necessarily a good thing. Regardless, no matter what they say, I must continue on. I think I can learn a lot by listening to Yoshida's speeches. Well then, I shall see you again soon. Perhaps I'll ask for your impressions again sometime.